we've all been here, running around doing errands only to come back to a car that feels like a complete sauna. So why do our cars get so hot in the summertime? That's what I'm answering in this week's episode of Heather's Weather Wise. It's amazing what even just a few minutes can do to a car that's been sitting in the sun. It's already uncomfortably hot in here. If I had left it for another 15, 20 minutes, the temperature could have easily jumped up into the triple digits. There have been many studies looking into the dangers of hot cars. One found that the dashboard can reach 156 degrees on a day when the outdoor air temperature is 95. The air in the car, a stifling 116. And that's after one hour. Another study from Stanford University found that the fastest warming happens within the first 15 minutes. But the air temperature actually isn't the most important factor here. What matters most is the sun. If it's out, our cars play host to a mini greenhouse effect. That's because the windshield glass allows all the visible and infrared light to pass right on through it. After that, the dark interiors of a lot of cars will absorb that infrared radiation and then re-emit it. We feel that radiation as heat. The problem is that the heat gets trapped inside the car and a feedback cycle starts to develop. That quickly drives the air temperatures up to dangerous, even deadly levels. On average, 37 children die each year in hot cars, and your pets are in peril in hot cars too. Compounding the problem is the fact that while the car is off, there's no moving air inside it. Now you may try to remedy that by cracking the window, but there's no way that that small sliver is going to allow enough heat to escape to keep up with the heat that's building thanks to the sun. And being in the shade doesn't help much. Remember that study I mentioned earlier? The same car on the same 95 degree day in the shade still got into the triple digits within an hour. Things like sun shields can help keep the temperature down a little bit, but ultimately in this summer heat, it's always better to be safe than sorry. Always remember to check the back seat and never leave your kids or pets in the car, even if it's just for a few minutes. That's gonna do it for this week's edition of Heather's Weather Wise. I'll see you next week with a new topic, but until then, stay cool and remember it's good to be a geek.